I was an actress from a young age and also did modeling on the side just because it was easy and, and it, it was money, but it was nothing that I was aspiring to do, nor could I really be like a supermodel. It was just catalog stuff and it, and it was nice to make money in high school yeah. and, and growing up. And then I went to a conservatory program at called Mason Grove School of the Arts. It's one of the top conservatory programs in the country for acting. And when I graduated, I was acting, I was doing well, but my manager and I weren't really on the same page. And so we had a bit of a falling out and I decided to take a year off from acting and just figure out if I wanted to do something else. But the plan was always to go back. I had signed a post-dated contract with a new manager and yeah, I fell into real estate. I mean, one of my girlfriends was like, well, if you don't want to bartend, why don't you try real estate? You can do it part-time and it's during the day and there won't be like weird men slipping you their hotel key at the bar, you know? So I got my real estate license. I ran around the first year sweating and gross and like in a rat race of New York City rentals because it's almost impossible to fall into sales. You really have to break into sales. And I realized that. And then I got a job as an assistant for a top producing agent. I was her assistant for about six months. And then I became a team member and a buyer's agent. And I was on teams until about 2010. And then I left, went on my own and started my own team. So I've been in the business since 2005. I learned so much from being on those teams. I also learned a lot of what not to do <laughs> and how not to treat people. But I think that's shaped me for sure in the way that I, I handle my own team. I really believe it's important to bring on people that are more intelligent than you, that have more to offer than you in certain areas so that you really are a team instead of being a team leader who tries to hold people down. I want people to yeah. evolve and elevate and become my partner possibly. Mm -hmm. So oh that's a nutshell. 